uh, so, as I understand, I'll probably die a lot <laughs> in this game. Oh I don't- boy. Oh, welcome back. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, let me capture for you too. Hey. This might be more mouse than anything. So I might want to grab my mouse actually. Yeah. <laughs> A little too Game Boy. Oh boy, that's pink. <laughs> Ooh, that oh, that is way no. too red. Flesh. Also... I don't know where it's grabbing my, that my name from. <laughs> but Steam it, name? It must be my Steam name, yeah. Wow. <laughs> oh no, it's CGA! It's CGA! Hell yeah! <laughs> God. Hell yeah! <laughs> I mean, CGA... If done correctly, isn't the worst thing? <laughs> like, <laughs> kind of like mythos. No, it's pretty, pretty sudden. This is pretty dark. There's a lot. Yeah. Wow. Seaweed. Moldy black. <laughs> Kinda black. <laughs> Old print. Deep Gold, Omen, Neon Slasher, Ooh. This is Gothic, Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Fair Day, Iron Rain, <laughs> Mondo, Mondo, Mondo Medicals, <laughs> Oh God, Blood Lord. <laughs> Skeletal King, that's kind of fun too. Yeah. Faded Pumpkin. Haircuts. Tarelka. Gardener. 
Seville watercolor leather face. Caution tape. Oh, that's that's the last one. Okay, and then the Um I kinda like It's also pretty good. Mm. Skeletal King is also kind of fun. E. Yeah, let's try, um... Sorry for flashing. We can try some of the more interesting ones after we see how this looks. <laughs> okay. Um. Oh, there's achievements. What's this button? <laughs> Check what events you've seen and how many you're still missing. Event base here, Pantheon. I can <laughs> edit events. Warning, this will reset your game's progress. Okay, so uh, I guess we'll just do a new story. Hi. Uh, would you like to customize your next playthrough's look? There are many color palettes. Uh, no, we're good. We already did that. If that's your first time playing World of Horror, it is recommended that you start with spine-chilling story of school scissors option before trying more complex playthroughs. <laughs> then. Death mode random. Starting new encounters will kill you if you drop below one stamina reason, but you can drop to negative five in combat. This option will allow you to rethink your strategy, forget spells, or use a healing item. Sudden death. Dropping below one stamina reason will kill you immediately. Just like real life. <laughs> yeah, this aesthetic is really good. Also, hi Matt! Hi Matt! As usual, you're welcome to join the call if you'd like, but no. Uh, don't feel obligated. Start your playthrough with a randomly chosen difficulty level. Get the full gameplay experience with a selection of tiny changes to make the dreadful town of Shiokala a more hos a hospitable place. Something weird is happening here, but I'm sure that together we can deal with it. Evil forces are gathering around Shiokala. Let's hope we can make it alive. We can't save everyone, but we have to try. This place is doomed. Flee while you still can. So this is... This is like really easy, I guess sort of easy, and then this is like normal. Start your playthrough randomly chosen timeline. Timeline choice determines changes in mysteries and their endings. Timeline B. Every year our city is visited by hundreds of tourists and interested in the paranormal. There's a lot of stuff going on here. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And it looks like we have different complexities here, so this is the easiest one. Uh, and then these are harder. A true chaos. Okay, so yeah, let's try Spine Chilling Story of School Scissors. A tiny section of a standard playthrough showcasing one of the available mysteries. City of Shiokawa, Japan, 1980X. Something strange is happening in our town. Hmm. 
robed figures can be seen gathering in the woods at night. People are going missing. Disgusting creatures are terrorizing the seaside. So it's still kind of loud, so I'm gonna turn that down just a little bit more. The rapid technological progress of the modern era brings comfort, but also new unknown threats. <laughs> this is an interesting poster we have in the background. <laughs> yeah. But we are very... This is very 90s. Check out this really chonky phone. 90s slash 80s, hell yeah. Old gods, malicious eldritch beings who ruled the earth eons ago, are awakening as reality starts to crumble. Armed with clues, spells, and your dwindling sanity, you'll investigate mysteries across the city and in realms beyond. An old train slows down and stops at its last station. The end of the world is at hand, and you've finally arrived in the doomed town. Welcome to World of Horror! Important messages will appear here. Uh, there's a lot to keep track of in this game, if I remember. Mm -hmm. So, uh, I'll do my best, but I'm probably... I'm sure they expect that you're not going to be able to keep understand everything the first time through. Mm. Like, what is this stuff? What is this stuff? <laughs> Cauterize? <laughs> no rituals active. Items, spells, status, options. Story so far. Doom zero. Yeah, I think that's the how fucked you are percent. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, we don't have we have no weapons, nothing. Um Cauterize is one of our spells, I guess. And then uh status. Strength 7, Dex 5 for 8. Okay. You've been following the weird cult for weeks now, barely surviving the encounter with the skin hag at the nursery. Mm -hmm. Uh, we missed a lot of stuff, apparently. Whoa. <laughs> well. It's a race against time, and you can't rest until our town is safe. Let's do combat tutorial on, thank you. <laughs> Spine-chilling story of school scissors. Another boy from your school has disappeared. Rumor has it, a terrible woman has returned from the grave. A woman with the widest smile and the sharpest scissors. You knew your friend was up to something when he left you his notebook full of cryptic notes. I can send her back where she belongs, he claims. After he disappeared too, you decided to study the notebook for clues. It details a ritual that can stop the wicked woman once and for all. What's the worst that could happen? <laughs> Alright, investigate this mystery. You've started a new mystery. The school is eerily quiet this hour. Your missing friend has left you a notebook. If the rumors are true, to stop the tall woman with scissors, you'll need to perform a ritual to force her material form to appear in our dimension. Accomplishing this requires first the drawing of an eldritch sigil and the lighting of holy candles. You can only hope your friend has left them somewhere around the school. Alright, so our storage... It's not like a little Cthulhu statue. It does look like a, like a baby Cthulhu statue. <laughs> it's just a little lad. Alright, let's take a look at a friend's diary. You retrieved an item from storage. 
Oh, these menus and everything, too. God. It's very... A... Triple A aesthetic. Mm-hmm. Absolutely nailed it. Okay. Um... 17 is... Sketched out for some reason. Uh... 14. Mother's acting strange. I need to talk with her after class. I hope she didn't attempt the ritual herself. I've hidden the candles in one of the classrooms. Tomorrow I will try to perform the ritual. This sigil can weaken the demon for a while. Careful with the lines. Okay, we need to remember this. Mm -hmm. It looks like a star. Six-pointed star? Is there something else in here? I can't quite tell. I can't quite tell. Also, a strange tall woman has been following me all day. I... must hurry up. Mm. Yeah. It's kind of hard to read the last part. Yeah. Probably on purpose. Yeah, of course. Okay. How do I get out of this... Um, we can explore the school, we can perform the ritual, or check out the school lockers. Can't do that yet, it looks like. Yeah. So, let's... We'll just have to investigate the school then. Investigating schoolyard. <laughs> you find an old trophy case set in a seemingly abandoned corridor. Everything inside is covered in a thick layer of dust. One metal seems particularly valuable. Needs tiny key item. Break the window to grab it. Check the plaques and trophies. Um, let's check out the plaques and trophies. Oh, our luck check was a success. Ha, huh, it seems the person involved with the current case was a prize-winning swimmer. Plus five experience. Okay. Bless chalk, not found. Holy candles, not found. You feel like something horrible is happening within the school. You must hurry and find those items. I don't know if we can actually click within any of these. Also, doom, 1%. <laughs> yeah, I think it just creeps up. Yeah. Not you clicking in 101! <laughs> Oh no! Impossible angles and seemingly moving lines make your head spin. Needs Ikumi ally. We'll just have to stare in disbelief. We have. Oh, we lost one reason. You found an additional page from your friend's diary. It seems that the blessed chalk was left in the pool. You must hurry and find it. Peek outside? <laughs> Uh... To open the door, click on the handle and drag. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> we're good. I think we're good. <laughs> this is fine. Uh. Oh yeah, the lockers. Can we? I need a tiny key. Oh! We'll take that. Um... Wouldn't... Blunt two-handed strength. Damage four, speed 80. Chance to hit 70. Slightly dusty. Uh, available... Oops. Okay, I equipped it. Uh, inspect. Baseball bat used by school's team. And we can put it in storage as well. Okay. What's, What's that? What? that? Did I just take damage? I can't tell. I, I'm not sure I wasn't. Oopsie. <laughs> Whoops. Okay. Anyway. Let's keep exploring then. 
You enter the damp, damp smelling sport wing. You notice a backpack drifting on a swimming board in the middle of the pool. Could it be what you're looking for? This doesn't seem like a good Boy. idea. <laughs> but here we go. You enter the pool hey. and start swimming towards the backpack. Suddenly the water turns murky and you realize you're not alone in the pool. Prepare for combat. A bloated figure emerges from the murky water, blocking your only way out of the pool. Okay, combat tutorial. During each turn, you'll build a sequence of attacks and moves from the action ring. Once you fill the launch, uh, fill the sequence bar, C, press the launch sequence button to finish your turn. So, offensive actions. The lower multiplier means the actions will take less time. Right click is delete last combat move. Kick! Attack without a weapon. So this bar is the the sequence bar, I guess is what actions we do in a turn. Right now we have 16 HP. Oh, this is the bloated teacher has 16 HP, minus two stamina for the damage, which uh I don't know where stamina is. Stamina is 17 right now. Okay, now we have 15 reason. Um and right now it has 20 power. So, defines enemy's stamina, getting it to zero wins the encounter. After each sequence, enemies perform an attack, draining your stamina, reason, or both. This stat defines your chance to successfully attack the enemy. The higher the power, the harder it will be. Currently, your chance to hit is lowered by 10%. Okay. I think I- I think I understand. <laughs> so, let's try... Uh, I think yeah. right now we're taking a warning hit, so... Kick. 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 Uh, yeah, that's all I can do, so... Alright, and then we took two, minus two stamina. With time, you will discover new combat moves available through the action filter, uh, A, which is this. But first, you need a weapon. I mean, I already have a weapon. Everyone back. <laughs> but this is the tutorial. But first, you need a weapon. Find and choose an action called Look for an Improvised Weapon. So, attack with your weapon. Strong attack. Carrier attack. Need, need a firearm. Attack boost. Look for an improvised weapon. Uh, this action requires an ally. Lowers your experience by 5 and raises your chance to hit by 10% for the rest of this encounter. Interesting. Where is my experience anyway? Oh, it's up here. Experience 11. Level 1. Uh oh. It... Here we go. One time use only. Need stamina or reason to be lower than three. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. An item has appeared in your upper right corner. That's your inventory. Click it and find the equip highlighted button. Defensive actions, spiritual actions. Uh, oh, ew. You okay? No, sorry, I read the. I'm, I'm reading the. Oh! Yeah, I'm not gonna read that out loud. <laughs> yeah, let's not. Um. So, 
So wait, my inventory, right? Where's... There we go. Broken bottle. I don't know if it's any, it's much better than the fast equip. <laughs> okay. All right, let's go. Got him. <laughs> nice. Uh oh, I've sustained a new injury. Bloated. You found blessed chalk, which you can use to draw the sigil in your ritual. You copy the sigil as best you can on the blackboard. Hopefully it will be enough. There's little like circle thing here. Is this correct? Looks like it might be. This one, right? Yeah. Okay. Dang. That should be the right sigil. What's that? What was the design? Okay. So now we need to find the candles. Mm -hmm. So I guess we'll just have to explore the school again. Investigating library. As you enter the school gym, you notice a strange black doll propped up against the wall. Oh, uh, gross incoming. Oh boy. Needs an eye glass. Come closer. Against your better judgment, you approach the doll. What you see makes you gasp in horror. The doll isn't a doll. Your sudden movement calls, <laughs> causes tiny black spiders to flee, revealing a white, half eaten corpse. Yep. The sound of scissors is getting louder. You must hurry. <laughs> Investigating the gym. Suddenly, everything slows to a crawl. Oh! Time warper! Uh -oh. One all? Phew. and weaker. <laughs> oh god. Up. Yeah, we're getting a little fucked up now. <laughs> oh no. Oh, we missed both. It's not great. Oh god. Where if we die? <laughs> we just need... There we go. Oh, we're quite Ooh. fucked up now, though. <laughs> we're doing so good. Blessed Chalk found- Okay, you found the holy candles in your friend's backpack. 
You lit them as instructed by the notebook. Everything is ready for the ritual. All right, it's time to perform the ritual. Do I, need, I, I don't have anything else in my storage, so we're just gonna have to, <laughs> just gonna have to go for it. <laughs> oh. Wait, what's that? Oh. You take a step back as a writhing amorphous mass slowly takes shape. Soon it becomes a tall, woman-like creature with three faces, all connected by a wide smile. Now it is your chance to fight and defeat this horror. It is also your only chance. Uh. Twisting and twitching, the demon woman enters the classroom, cackling menacingly. Am I beautiful? Snip, snip. Snip, snap. I don't think we're gonna... Yeah, what, what are... <laughs> we're gonna die, basically. <laughs> yeah. The, the little pan jive. Icons. The witch ones? The little, the little people doing little hand jives. Uh, prepare your attack. Time needed for you. Next attack is guaranteed to hit. Your next ah, attack okay. has an additional 10% chance to hit. This affects stats. Needs firearm. Okay. That might actually be helpful. Dodge! Drastically lowers the, the hit chance for the enemy. You can't run from this encounter. You can run from encounters. Or at least attempts to. Fill the combat sequence... Oh, what is this? Uh, brace for impact. Okay. There's a couple more things we can actually do. I didn't quite realize. I mean, it's your first time doing this. Yeah, this is this is like the demo demo of World of War, if I remember. This is like the first encounter kind of like demo. Mm-hmm. Um, but it, if I remember, it did get updated with more. Yeah. I just don't know if, um... I, I think it's literally like this is just the, hey, if you haven't played this before, try this. Also, just scissor woman stabs you. <laughs> Boy, how does she sure do? Survive this next hit. Uh, did you have something you could use when you were under three? Um, let's see. It doubles all damage dealt during this turn. Mm. Okay, we can try it. Desperation, basically. Frozen in fear, you watch as she gets closer. Her sharp scissors are slowly cutting through your cheeks as she asks you, Am I beautiful? <sighs> You've perished. <laughs> Congratulations, you died. You didn't complete any mystery. You saw four new events. You encountered three new enemies. You didn't lock any new achievements. <laughs> Mm, 
Okay. <laughs> well, that was our first try anyway, so... <laughs> Shop prepared a standard skeptic playthrough for you, allowing you to start the game without worrying about in-depth stuff for now. This option will start a new playthrough randomly selecting character, old god, background, and more. <laughs> oh boy. A true chaos, it says. <laughs> okay. Um. Hang on, sorry. I have to be right back again. Me? Won't take me too long.
about that. Boom! Do not, sorry. Welcome back. Thank you. So I don't know if I should try that bit again, or if I should just start, like, I guess, a new game. Mm -hmm. It's up to you. I just give it a try. Um, one more time. It's an upside down star with a little line thingy through it. <laughs> of course, everything that happens in these playthroughs are randomized, so we're probably not going to have the same things happen again. <laughs> <laughs> One time only. Okay, so we don't want to open that locker. Or the school. Back to the library. Oh, this one again. Hearing footsteps behind you, you realize you are not the only student here. A girl we wearing a demon's mask starts giggling as she's getting closer. There's something strangely charming about her. Oh dear. Young witch. Three damage all? Yikes. Yikes, girl. Slice through the toughest cuts of meat. You can only hope that the red stains are from steak. <laughs> Press X to doubt. <laughs> Should I try peeking outside again? Duh. <laughs> <laughs> go again. Yeah, I feel like this part always happens. Okay, that was a decent attack. Hey. Uh, it definitely helps to prepare the attack. Mm-hmm. It's taking a lot better now, hopefully. Okay, found the chalk. Now we're going 
to... There we go. That's the one. Nice. Now we're gonna find the candle. Oops. Staring both <laughs> disbelief. Man, I hate non Euclidean 101. Yeah, I really can't wrap my head around it. <laughs> Schoolyard. Uh oh. You are park. investigating park guest. Oh god, is this a jump scare? Hi. Hey, ah! uh, we found the holy candles. What's that? <laughs> you take a step back. Yep, now's a chance to fight her. Okay. <laughs> We've got little circles under our eyes right now. Yeah! Our reason's a bit lower than it's great. Okay, that was decent. Let's see if we can pull that off again. Hmm. I missed the other attack. Okay. Sorry, done four. We did it! Nice. Ancient horror lies dead on the classroom floor, slowly dissolving into nothingness. You find your friend, gravely wounded, but alive. You help him and you limp away from the school as the police sirens get louder. Yay, we got ending A! <laughs> Yay! The horror is over. For now. <laughs> oh, it recenters the... <laughs> it recenters the uh, window every time. <laughs> Rude. going on here. Pantheon meaning like a pantheon of elder gods. Probably. Thing forsaken by God. Mm -hmm. Banished to another dimension long ago. 
Goizel has found a way to use mirrors to ensnare and teleport its prey straight through the glass. Glimpses of horror lurking behind your reflection are just the beginning. Old God's Rule. Resting at home raises doom. <laughs> Backstory, World of Horror. Character exclusive perk cards only. Welcome to World of Horror. Uh, first time playing, click here. <laughs> Welcome! And thank you for trying World of Horror! Inspired by adventure games from the 80s, the visual overload may be a little disorienting in the beginning. In this short tutorial, I'll do my best to explain various elements and prepare you to fight the horrible old gods. Uh, Powell, creator of the game. Uh, that's the main game screen. Here you will interact with your surroundings, solve mysteries, and fight enemies. All performed actions will be added to the log here. That's the user interface part of the screen. Here you'll manage your inventory, cast spells, and access the game options. That's you! <laughs> World of Horror has RPG elements, and your attributes are described by six basic stats. Mouse, uh, move your mouse over them to learn more. Strength, Dexterity, Perception, Knowledge, Charisma, and Funds. <laughs> Man, we only have six bucks to our name. Or six yen? <laughs> six whole money. Uh, that's your inventory. You can keep up to four items. Click here to inspect, use, or equip anything you pick up. There are three equipment slots. Equipped items do not count towards the four items limit. A. Weapon used in combat, B and C. Trinkets and armor. Additional tabs will take you to your spells, current status, and options. As you progress with your playthrough, more helpful tips will appear. Would you like to turn the combat tutorial on? Uh, we've already done it, so no. Okay. So, uh, let's do this thing, I guess. So what what do we do? What are we how many Fuck spells? Fuck around and find out, I guess. Don't know much in terms of status. We don't really have any allies. A feeling of paranoia and discomfort is almost palpable in the air. As doom progresses, old god's influence will slowly corrupt and change this calm seaside town. Goizo, thing forsaken by God. Mirror horror, resting increases doom penalty. Fun. <laughs> Yay. Okay, I guess, um... Let's go to the lighthouse? The ominous lighthouse has been closed down for, f for longer than you can remember. Multiple padlocks prevent you from the building, uh, from entering the building. You need five keys. God. That's a lot of keys. That is a lot of keys. Again. <laughs> You've already- oh, we have? <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> You check your mailbox. It's it. Empty. <laughs> Whoa. Back in your home, you think of your next move. You're not currently investigating any weird mystery. Recent newspaper clippings and notes collected in the next in the next room should point you in the right direction. Choose oh my god, we have a conspiracy board. <laughs> oh my god, we really do. Starting a mystery. Back to town screen. Take a peek through the peephole. That seems like a bad idea, like always. I don't wanna. Watch TV. Take a bath. Change clothes. Access your 
have storage. Don't have anything in storage. Someone standing in the shadow watching your door. <laughs> Find some money. <laughs> wow. Looking good. You found a new item. Empty bottle. Can be used to store liquids. Okay. <laughs> you can sell items too. So this is, this is like, you're technically supposed to, this is a long-term kind of like thing. <laughs> Try to survive as long as you can, I guess. Light switch? You could leave something to charge here. It's a nice day outside. <laughs> Inexplicable and morbid events have been plaguing your town for some time now. You've marked down five of them, hoping that there is something connecting them. You can tackle these five mysteries in any order you want. Beware, your decisions will haunt you and influence yet unsolved mysteries. Interesting. Take a cutty. <laughs> Clues. Chilling Chronicle of a Crimson Cape. Eerie Episode of Evolving Eels. <laughs> Freaky Feature of Found Footage. <laughs> Spying Chilling Story of School Scissors. Um, well let's try something we haven't done yet, right? So...